News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update uh, on this Friday, the 3rd of uh, June. We're looking at the Dow down 186 at 33,062. Really nice, over 400 point rally yesterday. Almost in increased leg A to the upside. Instead, we've made a peak A. This is now a buy signal, technically, waiting to get a confirmation of a buy mode. That'll happen if we can close above the uh, high of yesterday, which was 33,000. I believe it was 272. I typed it enough times. Uh, uh, 33,000. 272, yes. That was the high of three days ago. What we're looking at is uh, the S&P. So this sell-off so far is starting to find some, some footing. And the S&P is down 38 to 41.37. Was as low as 41.17, 20 points off that. So, and that was a leg C to the upside. Looking at the QQQ, NDX 100 is trading at uh, 310. Um, Minus four. That was a really good rally yesterday. Actually, it was a very good rally yesterday. Let's see if we can get back at least some of that. We've had a pullback, the expected pullback that I said to subscribers to open your call. We can anticipate that. Now we're looking at the IWM, which is the Russell 2000 acting very well, down 86 cents at 187.92. Uh, in a leg C, this is quite good action. Let's look at gold. Gold at this particular point is down uh, five points at 1866. Uh, it's right on the 200 period moving average. Let me just see the GDX. The GDX is under the two. It's in leg D under the 200 period moving average. This is going to be a very big uh, test of gold's strength. The dollar is holding quite nicely. It's up 20 cents at 101.97 in a digestive phase since the 105 uh, high that was made just a week and a half ago. We're looking at the uh, TLT, which is bonds. Bonds are down again, down 94 to 115. So, the bond market is doing the Fed's work for it. It keeps pushing those rates higher. What can I say? Looking at crude oil, and that's going to be very interesting. Yesterday, this time I said crude is down. No, it was actually up in the end. And now it's up again, 99 cents at 117.86, holding really well. Trying to get back to that 120 level, just under 120. We'll see what happens. The day is young. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. This is going to be a very interesting show because we've got a lot to look at, a lot of positives and a couple of negatives. See you soon. Otherwise, check out my opening call, my daily newsletter. Have a great day. This is Sharpening your 